the patient in supine, flex the patient's knee to approximately 90 degrees with the foot flat on the table. With the patient's permission, stabilize the leg by sitting on the foot. Grasp the tibia with both hands with thumbs on the tibial plateau. Push the tibia posteriorly. Increased translation compared to the opposite side indicates a partial or complete tear of the PCL. Houston's drawer test can also be performed to test for posterior rotary instability. To test for posterior lateral instability, place the tibia in approximately 15 degrees of external rotation and repeat the same procedure. The tibia is placed in approximately 15 to 20 degrees of internal rotation to test for posterior medial instability.